Who knows what the fuck she's doing now? She fell off the tower. And... I mean, she can live through that. It's not like she's a robot or anything, or... People have flight suits that could magically come to our rescue, or a number of other things. Oh, well, this has got to be the end, because we got the president. He's always at the end. At least in this one. Beautiful world unlocked. Holy shazbot. You'd think there'd be more debris from that tower falling, but nope. <sighs> one enemy remains. I wish it just zoom in on the moose's eye and then it has a wry smile at the end, like it was its plan all, the lo all along. But no, no. That's what the C ending is, the Canadian victory. Chapter select can now be accessed from the title screen and access points. So I guess this is your way to get a variety of endings. I would like to just try to get the last ending where we tried to play as 9S, honestly. Debug menu can now be accessed using our right trigger and back. Uh-huh. Activating debug menu will disable all save functionality. Okay. You can also use the debug room. Give me access from the start menu. At the debug room, you can even use the debug menus free to freely place enemies. You also got heavy armor, camouflage goggles, and the A2 wig. Okay. And you got a machine research report. The strange resistance woman has a new topic to talk about. Talk to her at the resistance camp to find out what it is. I may leave it. Yes, save. We shall save here. Okay, you can try getting the 9S chapter ending through chapter select. Well, let's go ahead and do that. And that'll be the end of this playthrough. So let's see. Chapter select, huh? So how did it say I used chapter select before? I I have to continue the game, right? I have to do it from the transport thingies, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use this one. Yeah, chapter select. Here it is. Alright, in the tower. Here it is. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hopefully we don't have to go through that entire sequence again, but, you know. Okay, we can access sub-chapters, too. Here it is. The defining moment. So now you can choose either one. Question marks? My favorite. <laughs> An A2 wig. Well, you know, it can be a synthetic wig. Made out of, you know, the most natural of news fi uh, moose fibers. If it wasn't th synthetic, see? Come on. You know, that's why their hair's all white, by the way. It's made out of them white nieces. This tower, if we don't do Giant something, cannon, blah, so blah, blah, it's crazy. Rabble cakes. Damn it, rabble cakes. Rabble cakes. Rabble cakes. Shut up! You two, that's all. To be caught. The nine but the model. The official designation? Yes, yes. Make your choice. We will go as 9S. Are you sure? Yes. And yes, as a final request, I think I will do that. How the hell do I equip? You know, it's been so long since I've equipped, like, uh, aesthetic items, but I don't remember. A2 A. I can't equip it. So yeah, only A2 can wear this. That's regrettable. Oh, <laughs> that'd be some shit if I can make 9S wear it, right? I'll say that A2 has some serious defenses. Oh boy. What's got me shooting? Nine X. It doesn't matter. Why do I long for humans like this? Why do I desire the touch of something that Hmm. I almost wanna I'm actually gonna slow it down so we can hear some of his speech. Cause he has some interesting things to say, it sounds like. I'll try not to win too fast. That's hard for me. Also, holy shit, we have a man to get this one done? Damn. 
Damn it, you stupid thing. Don't I have time for your buffoonery? I mean, it's got to be a little longer. Made. Androids were designed to protect their human masters. Our core programming demands that we shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> Just destroy it. <laughs> it all goes away. That'll solve everything. Damn it. Okay, I think he's done. Oh my goodness, a different perspective. Such immersion. It's like I'm right here in the little cyber ship. Makes aiming kind of a bitch, but it's not that bad. <laughs> oh, he almost got me. Except when you didn't. What the fuck is this? We got a maze? Okay, I gotta destroy all the things still. A seat back there, but I still need to destroy everything. For sightseeing, we gotta get moseying. Although this one doesn't appear to have a time limit, which is sort of interesting. We have one hit left. Let's make it happen. Ah, God damn it! But wait, there's more. Call now and get additional things to shoot for absolutely free. As we spin off into Never Never Land. Why are we spinning out in the Never Never Land? I don't know. I don't care for it. Getting dizzy. What the fuck is this? I'm in the <laughs> in the items menu. What could it mean? But it says A2 status, not my status. Do I need to like go over there and shoot her, shoot her health points? What does it mean? <laughs> Oh, it finally broke. I thought I had to do something special. <laughs> Are you done? I will hack you another time. Sure. Oh, this is sort of... <laughs> this is sort of underwhelming after that last one, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe it just demonstrates how much weaker she's become after all those hacking attempts. Right in the artificial baby maker. Wait, he got stabbed too, though. Well, poop. Man, she took a lot better than you did. Oh, the pain, the pain of it all. So dramatic. Well,
Fatal system error detected. Memory leak verified. Repair impossible. <laughs> Lethal raises an eyebrow. That's not how memory leaks work. <laughs> Beginning emergency evacuation of remaining memories. So is it going to be reborn as yet another 9S? I hear things typing. I'm... I'm guessing this is 9S, that's why I'm using that voice. My name is... My name is 9S. Lethal is correct yet again. A newly manufactured scanner model. January 30th, 11,942. Rolled out at 4.25 a.m. bunker time. I will fight for humanity with all my strength. The pleasure is mine, Commander. I lie collapsed in a state of blinding light. The pain is gone. The light envelops me. It's ever so warm. I was anxious. A soldier from the a soldier from the moment I was born, thrown into a world into the world alone. Nothing to rely on. No god to believe in. I was alone. Tasked with infiltrating enemy territory to gather intel intelligence. In the fog. In the flames. Alone. My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. 2B came off as being rather aloof, cold even. She must have wanted to distance herself from me. I guess she didn't want to be attached to someone she had to kill again and again and again and possibly a fourth time. But I... Scanners like me mostly work alone. Scouting out enemy lines and all that. <clears throat> I don't usually get a partner, it's kind of fun. I was so happy to be with someone finally. It was like I had a family. My damage worsens. I start to lose my memories. The space fills up with pure white light. It's like being buried in snow. It's a little bit cold. It's a little bit frightening. Will my soul disappear? A dark fog clouds my vision. As it ebbs and flows in its slow dreamlike way, I gradu it gradually takes a human shape. It's the red girl. She slowly begins to speak. This tower is a colossal cannon built to destroy the human server. Maybe this is still him saying it. Destroy, and destroy the server and rob the androids of their very foundation. That plan was devised by those girls. But they changed their mind. They saw us androids. They saw Adam. And Eve. They saw how we lived. And considered the meaning of existence. Finally, they didn't before we came along. And came to a different conclusion. This tower doesn't fire artillery. It fires an arc. An arc containing memories of the foolish machine life forms. An arc that sends those memories to a new world. I have to stop for a second. So you're saying that this has happened before in a separate world and they fired this damn thing at Earth and that maybe that's what the alien things were? Maybe? I don't know. Like, I like to think that may have happened too. It probably isn't though. Perhaps they'll never reach that world. 
perhaps they'll simply wander an empty sky for eternity. It's all the same to the girls. For them, time is without end. Adam and Eve are inside the Ark. Eve is asleep. Adam holds him in a gentle embrace. He seems to be smiling at me, and I think he may have actually given me a wink, too. I try to look up at him, but my body refuses to let me. Looks like the damage has spread to my motor functions as well, and also lighten up my text. Will you come with us? asks Adam. The question was completely free of malice. It seemed I no longer had a reason to hate machines. Maybe I never had a reason in the first place. What have I been fighting for? Who have I been living for? I don't know anymore. I try to speak my mind, but the words don't come out right. My thought routines are losing cohesion. I don't... I can't remember my name. I'm... Mustering all of my strength, I force out the words. I go with you, I stay. Shit, there's multiple endings again, god damn it. <laughs> Please, we'll put up a poll. <laughs> Hopefully the game does not choose for us. As it is so wont to do. If it does, then, well, poo. Right? It hasn't chosen... No, I guess it has. Never mind. I guess we're going with them. I'm sorry, folks. I try. I'll go with you. I'm sure we'll be able to come back to this point. We, your hall, have no right to remain in this world. Maybe small balls. The second time I get to choose? Okay. Da -da -da -da. Seems like a very odd launch platform, but what do I know? It's 100% worth it. Oh my god. Well, there's Pascal still wandering around. There's our resistance members. Going, what the fuck is that? Alright. Childhood's end. So has Nines become a man in this ending? Or has the species, or at least the life form, the machine life form, become an adult, right? Also, I cannot skip this, apparently. Well. <sighs> Pressing every button I got here, folks. I'm sorry. Oh, fucking God damn it! Okay. One second, I'll fix this. Maybe. Oh, God damn it, saying things. This now confirmed offline. Our mission to oversee the progress of Project Yorha is complete. Proceeding to final stage of project. Commencing deletion of all data. Pod 153 to pod 042. Data noise present in stream. Requesting temporary halt to perform data check. Uh, sure. Pod 042 to pod 153. Data confirmed. Personal data for units 9S, 2B, and A2 appear to be leaking out. Oh, God damn it. Pod 153 to pod 042. Follow project rules and delete all personal data. I do not pod want to follow the rules. To pod 153. Personal data deletion request denied. <laughs> Playing by the rules is for nerds. To pod 042. Failure to parse statement. Pod you say what, motherfucker? To pod 153. There was data created in my banks as I was referencing the records. I realized something. I have come to the conclusion that I cannot accept this resolution. The destruction of all Yorha units is an essential component of the project plan. 
All data must be destroyed. Pod 042 to pod 153. Repeat. Personal data deletion request denied. Initiating data salvage. Pod 153. You hoped they would survive as well, didn't you? We lack the authority for such an action. The rules are protected by low-level systems. Salvaging data poses an unacceptable level of risk. Knowing